Hello, welcome to my channel. My name is Teresa. I have a Facebook page also, Griffin Art and Airbrushing. Um, I would like to tell you a little bit about myself since this, this is my first video. I started airbrushing in 1990 on the Gulf Coast in Mississippi. I was there for three years. I did many, many t-shirts over those three years. Too many to count. Um, my hand hurts just thinking about it. Um, and then, uh, I really enjoyed doing that. And then I moved away from the beach, which was a little bit problematic, a little bit. Uh, you can still find places to airbrush, such as what I did was car shows. Um, I also set up at a mall with some fellow airbrush artists over the holidays, and we did airbrush t-shirts and things like that car tags, stuff like that. Um, anyway, I've done many of those. I've always been an artist, but when I moved to Mississippi, I did not have a job, so I began airbrushing, and it was nice enough for the people at the souvenir store to teach me how to do it. Um, what is an airbrush? How does it work? You know, what's a single action? What's a double action? All those questions go through your mind when you first start airbrushing. So this channel, I hope, will help people learn more about airbrushing. Uh, maybe you have questions. Maybe I can answer them. Um, I don't know everything. I will tell you that right now. And I don't do things the way everybody does it. I do things differently. Um, everybody has their own way. Um... But anyway, it's nice to meet you. And here tonight, I'm sitting in front of a Dodge tailgate, which I've just started to sketch on what we have is, see this pirate theme? Look at that. All right, now things look a little goofy because it's just a sketch. I'm trying to get my lines where they are supposed to be. And, um... So what we have here, the tailgate was painted and cleared, and then the clear has been sanded down with a high grit sandpaper. Um, and then I wiped it down with rubbing alcohol to get any fingerprints off of it. You don't want any oils or fingerprints on there because they will show up or they will lift uh, certain things like paint or clear. So it's got to be clean. Um, I'm using this white charcoal pencil to put them on. And I'm using some references to draw them. And I think it's going to be pretty cool. Uh, this guy looks really neat right now. I like him. This guy looks really scared. You see him right there? And down this way, we are going to have a ship eventually. And... Further down, we're going to have a Grim Reaper over there somewhere. So it's kind of a really cool idea, I think. So if you just want to follow my channel, like, subscribe, and we will go through this tailgate together within the next couple of weeks. So thanks for watching. Bye.